My name's Gareth Lane, uh, and I've been working as, a, as an organiser for the Bakers' Union for the last eight, 18 months, organising in, in the fast food industry amongst some of the uh, poorest workers facing some of the worst conditions that we have uh, in, in the economy. So uh, I, I'm going to talk a little bit about we, where we are with our campaign, and then I'm going to introduce various speakers from different campaigns, and also we've got a a live link up with, with a guy called Jarrell from the Fight for 15 in the United States. Uh, but we're having a few technical issues as we always do with Skype, so, so we'll, we'll deal with that when it comes. Uh, the, 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 the fight for the £10 an hour minimum wage organising amongst fast food workers is starting to uh, really start, start to, to get us some results in, in terms of membership, but also in terms of uh, influence as well. We've organised around several workplaces. We're, we're doing well around Witherspoons and KFCs and McDonald's and we now have several branches of workers up and around the country. We also recognise that we have to do more work in London so we did, we, we're spending a lot more time around here and we've recruited a fair chunk of workers now in London and we're very close uh, to putting together a branch in London of, of fast food workers. Uh, some of the other sessions have also talked about some of the successes that, that the campaign has had in terms of organising in these areas. We have, we have a pub worker here today who's managing to uh, force his employer to, to bring in guaranteed hours from a set of zero hour uh, workers. So it's a real achievement. Uh, but uh, the campaign is, is, is based around the idea pound an hour minimum wage. Uh, we're starting to get some real support for building an organisation around a ten pound an hour minimum wage. Uh, if, if this keeps cutting out, right, uh, that sounds much better, doesn't it? Right. So, uh, in, in in the particular area that I live in, Sheffield, I want to report something that's quite interesting about uh, what happened there. We had a meeting there three, three or four weeks ago, I can't remember now, but we had John McDonnell come and speak uh, amongst a coalition of, of trade unionists from uh, the GMB Unite, the Bakers Union uh, and some Unite community activists and we managed to draw 250 people to a meeting around the idea of building a campaign for a £10 an hour minimum wage in the city. Uh, we had a very, very good positive meeting with everybody agreeing that we should form a campaign and take that campaign forward. The, uh, we then had a, st a first steering group meeting last week, which was very, very interesting. We had around 25, 26 people there, but we had some people in the room that had a little bit of weight in terms of we had local councillors, we had representation from eight different unions, uh, the new, newly elected uh, uh, Secretary of Sheffield, Momentum, was there. So what we're starting to do is build alliances in the city around the idea of building a campaign for £10 an hour. Now, the idea of this is to go out and reach workers that are currently unorganised with our, with our partners in this coalition in terms of the GMB, Unite, the CWU, uh, and, and also the Bakers Union. So we'll go out, we'll organise activity around recruiting workers into these workplaces whilst we're building for a demonstration in the city that will march through the city centre for a £10 an hour minimum wage. And this is going to be on the 17th of December on a Saturday and I'm hoping that people from different areas can come and join us, show a bit of solidarity. And I also think as well that there's a real opportunity to push out £10 an hour campaigns into different areas, using trades councils to get involved, building alliances with different unions around this issue. I really think this is something that can draw a lot of people into activity. Very interestingly, the, the Momentum members that we've got involved are saying that they're very tired of doing the internal labour stuff, that they're looking for some real campaigning work, looking to get out and do some activity around their communities and stuff, and this is a perfect uh, way of doing it. So I hope you can join us on the 17th of December in Sheffield.